Hey, how's it going everybody? Welcome to my channel. First of all, I just want to thank everybody who subscribed. Just want to say thank you for uh, subscribing to my channel. So today I have another quick video for you guys. I'm going to do a quick speed test between the S22 Ultra. This is the Snapdragon model, Snapdragon 8 Gen 1 with 8 gigabytes of RAM and 128 gigabytes of internal storage. This is the S21 Ultra with 12 gigabytes of RAM and the Snapdragon 888. So we got the new Snapdragon versus last year's Snapdragon. Let's see who will win. So first I'm just going to show you guys that we have no app saved in the memory. There we go, both are completely empty. And we're gonna to get to the speed test right now. Okay, so first we have the phone application. So let's get that open. One, two, three. That looked almost exactly the same to me. Okay, next we have the calculator application, just the stock uh, calculator app. One, two, three. Again, that looked exactly the same to me. Let me guy, let me know what you guys think. Okay, now we have the clock app. One, two, three. Okay, that didn't work. Once again, clock app. One, two, three. Very close. I don't know. You guys tell me about that one. Looked about the same. Okay, camera app, one, two, three. That looked like the S21, maybe. S21 Ultra, I think, on that one. Let's close it up. Okay, now we have Mozilla, Firefox, and uh, yeah, I'm not using the stock internet app, so uh, using Mozilla. So one, two, three. That looked about the same again. Again, I could be wrong on these, so if you guys see me missing one, because I feel like I am, just let me know down in the comments. Okay, we got the Play Store. One, two, three. That looked like the S22 Ultra. Okay, so next we got the Galaxy App Store. So one, two, three. That looked like the S21 loaded up just like a hair faster. Got everything done just like just a split second faster. Okay, now Sportsnet. One, two, three. Wow, again, S21 Ultra. Now the S22 Ultra has been out, I think, for about three months now. So it's had a couple of updates, but um, still looks like the Galaxy S21 Ultra is a bit snappier on some apps, but let's see how it does in the game. So we got Call of Duty, one, two, three. Oh, sorry. Okay, I messed up Call of Duty the first time, so I deleted it. As you can see, deleted it from the RAM. So I'm gonna try it again. So Call of Duty, one, two, three. There we go. Oh. So they opened up different screens, but it looked like the S21 Ultra opened uh, opened everything faster, I think. Again, let me know. This keeps rotating into landscape mode. Um, but yeah, I think Call of Duty was the S21 Ultra. Okay, last game, Subway Surfers. One, two, three.
Wow, again, S21 Ultra. I'll give it to the S21 Ultra. I don't know what it is. Okay, and that's it, guys. So that kind of surprised me because I thought the S22 Ultra would open the games a lot faster than the S21 Ultra. I don't know. I did a couple of tests like before, before I started shooting, and it looked like the S22 Ultra was opening the games just a little faster. So I don't know if it's just luck of the draw, but they're very close either way. I think if you have the S21 Ultra, like the S22 Ultra is so close in performance that I wouldn't say you're going to notice anything huge. And that's it, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, let me know down in the comments if you were surprised by those results. If I missed any, let me know too. Again, thanks to all my subscribers. If you're not subscribed and you like these types of technology videos and review videos, um, I also do some how-to videos. I try to post to my I try to post to my channel at least once a week. Uh, give this video a like if you enjoyed it, and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.